Well, good evening, everybody. I hope everybody's having a wonderful new year. I'd like to welcome you to the very first New Year's edition, not New Year, you know, but the New Year's edition of What the Heck is Jim Eating? Now, today we have some beef jerky. My wife and son went to a um, place up in Pennsylvania last week, and they got me back some jerky. So we're going to try four different flavors of jerky today. I got my water here so I can refresh, you know, my, my palate. Alligator. Kangaroo. Beef buffalo. And one that I have not tried yet. And um, I, I've actually had buffalo, gator, and kangaroo before. Not the jerky, though. I've had the meat. One I have not tried yet. We'll save this one for last. Camel. So, sit back. Relax. Pull up a chair. Grab a drink. And join me as we figure out what the heck is Jim eating. And here we go. We're going to start off with the uh, alligator, shall we? So let's cut this off here. And uh, try to open it up. Okay. Now, we're going to eat like yeah, about that much. It's not going to be a whole lot. So let's put it back in here. Now, alligator actually tastes very good. I had alligator for the first time up at uh, Knoebel's Amusement Park years back. I mean, uh, I, I was shocked at how good it was. So, here's what it looks like. It just looks like a thin piece of meat. And uh, we'll see now if, it's, uh, if it works as jerky. I could taste the sweetness of the gator. Mmm. I like this. Wow. Mmm. Wow. This is really good, Regina. Wow. Mmm. Okay. Well, it has a nice sweet taste to it. Gator meat is sweet. And um, I, I enjoy it. I think that it was really good. I like the taste of it. And um, alligator jerky. It's good. All right. Next, we're going to try another one that I've tried before. Kangaroo. Now, keep in mind, I've never had these type of jerkies before. I've only had the regular meat of them. So now we're going to try the kangaroo jerky. If I can get it open like the last one. Hold on a second here. Ah. Well, oh my gosh. Come on, give me a break here. Now, just so you know, kangaroo meat, it is a sweet tasting meat. Sort of like the alligator. It it's it has a regular meat taste, but there's also a sweetness to it. So <coughs> oh, wow. <coughs> Starting to taste it now. Okay, there we go. Okay. So now we're gonna try kangaroo. Oh, by the way, if any of you animal activists out there see this video and you're getting angry at me, sorry. Here we go. This is what it looks like. I mean, they all look the same anyway. So here we go. Mmm. 
Mmm. Mmm. Wow. I could taste the sweetness already of the meat. Mmm. Wow, this is also really good. Mm. Oh, there we go. Looks like we got another winner on our hands as well. So far, kangaroo <clears throat> and alligator. Two winners. Now, it's been a while. It says I had a kangaroo burger, but I do remember the meat was sweet, and it had a good taste to it. You know, it's just like, it's, it tastes sweet. <laughs> I mean, that's about it. So, so far we got two winners. We got kangaroo, we got alligator. Let's refresh the palate. All right. Number three. <clears throat> Buffalo jerky. Now, I've never had buffalo jerky. So keep that in mind. I've eaten buffalo, and I think buffalo meat is the best meat out there you can buy. It just, it has a great taste to it. It's not rough. Like, for example, <clears throat> some people say that emu is really good. Ugh. Emu is the worst. I had an emu burger in St. Louis. I wanted to try it. And <clears throat> it was horrible. It was dry. It was scaly. It was rough. I mean, it was just really bad. All right. Kangaroo, uh, buffalo. But this is chipotle and garlic flavor. So this gives a little, a little touch to it. <clears throat> Another palate. Okay, <clears throat> and here we go. Well, I can... Taste the bu I taste the buffalo, of course. I taste a tiny hit of chipotle. And uh, I'm a big fan of garlic. I can't taste that much garlic in it. Maybe they cut back on the garlic, you know, for some reason. Um... I don't know. My recommendation for this one, if you can get <clears throat> buffalo jerky, get buffalo jerky straight up. Don't get it with chipotle and garlic. I think it 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 defeats the purpose of the jerky. It doesn't taste like buffalo jerky, you know. So, here we go. <sighs> Now, the surprise. We're going to try camel. I have never, ever had camel. I have never, ever even considered having camel. I would... <clears throat> I would have camel like I would have horse, okay? And I would never eat a horse. So, but... <laughs> I'm going to eat camel, but I'm never going to eat a horse. I'll tell you that right now. Just keep that in mind. All right. I have no idea what camel tastes like, so. <clears throat> and I've never smoked, so, but I hope it doesn't taste like the cigarette. And here we go. Don't try this at home, kids. I'm a professional. Hmm. 
Well, it has like a regular beef jerky taste. I mean, I know that there's, I said there's beef jerky in these, okay? But it, it tastes like a regular beef jerky. There's a little bit of an underbite of a little bit of heatness. Now, that might be from the chipotle, from the uh, buffalo garlic, or that just might be how the camel is. It's not bad, you know. I mean, truthfully, though, if, if, if I go out to a store and I see camel meat, first of all, I'll be shocked because it's illegal. But they don't sell it in the United States. But I don't know. They might sell. Anyway, if I see camel meat, I'm not going to go out and get, you know, a pound of ground camel, you know? Now, I would definitely go out and get maybe, you know, I would get kangaroo. I'd go in the uh, seafood aisle. I'd get alligator. I'd get regular buffalo, of course, but I will not go out and get ground camel. That's just, you know, I just, it's probably too much money and it's it's not worth it, so... It's good, you know, but like I said, it just tastes just like regular beef jerky. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed uh, the four flavors of jerky that I tasted for you. And let's just hope I'm not going to spend the rest of the night on the toilet. I'll talk to you later. Ciao.